You know, not everyone has good days, even divers. So after I hit 20,000 followers on Facebook, I threw the dart at the map from back over here, my eyes closed, and I hit Modena, Wisconsin, right here. So the plan was to go to Medina, Wisconsin, clean up the waterways there, and that night head over to Alma, Wisconsin, uh, right on the Mississippi River here, here's Minnesota, and we were gonna go check out the Great Alma Fishing Float, and then the next day we're gonna dive it, clean it up. Didn't really go as planned. Aww. Aww. What's that? Just said something. We just made it to Medina, Wisconsin. Just did an interview at Lindstrom, the equipment place there in town. Today we're here in uh, Medina, Wisconsin. What is what is the most popular thing that people do around here? Farming or what? Everybody around here mainly farms, yep. You know, there's a lot of hunting and there's a lot of fishing here. So typical <laughs> out in the country stuff. Just like where I grew up, small town called Lena, but I was in the country. I see that you guys have a river nearby here, Buffalo River, and there's like another pond you said. If somewhere to dump something around here uh, to try to dispose of it, get rid of it. Do you think those would be good spots for that? It probably wouldn't be the worst part, uh, place to start. I know that little pond you're talking about there has been called the slough for years. Okay. And uh, it's pretty muddy, you know, so I don't know really what's going to be in there. And the river bridge that you're talking about mm -hmm. down there, um, of course, as the road goes over it, and you know what happens there. Yep. You know, are there any kind of legends or folklore around here of anything missing or uh, stuff that's been dumped over there? No, nothing I can really think of. Okay. Well, thank you for your time, Steve, and it's nice to meet you. you bet. Thanks for uh, thanks for letting us come in your nice, cool shop. That's right. It's like 95 out there right now. Pretty warm. But uh, this is really the only spot here, in Medina. There's like a pond here, um, and on the other side too, it's all green. Uh, there's a river right over here. It's too shallow though, so we can't really dive that. But this here looks a little deeper, really dark. I think we're gonna try to dive it a little bit, um, try to throw some magnets in here, see what we find. Oh, oh, oh rail to rail. Good luck, buddy. There you go. Now get stuck under the bridge. A lot of bubbles coming up in here as you're pulling back. So that means it's pretty mucky down there. They're stirring it up. Then come to the other side over here. Dive around this green stuff. Hopefully there's no uh, snappers in here and no uh, snakes. Let's go get it. Might have been a bad idea. I see some trash down here. At least we'll get something out of here. There we go. Got something. <laughs> you guys want to go try? Try it out by the river there in the deeper spot? Well, it's like three, four feet deep there, but the current's coming through, pushing the stuff away. I can't see nothing down here, it's all muck. All right, got the boys off the bridge. Take the magnets down that way, and I'm gonna dive over there. Hopefully we can find something. Came to the Buffalo River, not leaving empty-handed. Got some plastic right here. Got throw in there. Got some more random things right here. Let's pick up over here. Good spot. So what, what are you looking for? We didn't we we'd go uh, travel around and clean up areas and I threw a map at the dart and this is where it landed. Oh, okay. <laughs> but uh we're gonna head down to Alma next, the great the great Alma fishing float. A foot and a half maybe deepest. It's horrible. And then the sand is constantly washing over, so pushing sand. Smells like a uh, horse manure. Oh, yeah. But yeah, I'm sure a lot of farm fields draining down into it. Okay. Thanks. All right, almost done. Well, at least you got this stuff. It's not gonna end up in the river. To get it out the banks, good stuff. So the boys made it back to the truck, sitting in the AC, asked them to come pick me up down there. They didn't want to get out again and come get me, so uh, I'm gonna make them walk the rest of the way to Alma. Like, yeah, like that. all that happened. Let's discuss the details. All right, on the way to Alma. Let's get it. Soon we will be heading over there to the Minnesota side to the Great Alma Fishing Float. That's 
where we'll be diving tomorrow, throwing some magnets, and there is the dam. Pretty neat. It's a big place. About to get a ride here on the Great Alma Fishing Float Barge. Can't wait.